All right, what's up, everybody? It's vlog time again with the crew. We've already screwed up once tonight, but that does not going to stop us from. No, no, from... no. We didn't screw up. You screwed up. Okay, I screwed up already once by picking a fifty-dollar parking spot, which costs more than my ticket. But um, we're at a Tigers game tonight. The Blue Jays are in town, um, so I'm gonna show you around Comerica Park, hang out with these hooligans, and uh, and uh, we're gonna have a lot of fun. So. Uh, it's my first time here in five years, so I hope to find some new stuff. I'm going to show you around some stuff around the stadium, get some cool food, and have a fun at the game. So hopefully they win, and let's do this. Take a look at the outside of the stadium here. All the Tigers that are lined up along the outside of the stadium. The outside here, there's some big bats. A bunch of cool stuff around this beautiful skyline night here in Detroit. But uh, we're gonna head in now, and uh, let's head in, right? Finally inside after that stupid security session. No, it's not stupid, Tyler. You're stupid. <laughs> Shut up, okay? <laughs> he made me literally unload everything I had when he just said keys and wall uh, keys and phone needed to be unloaded. That's how they work, Tyler. Shut up. Shut up. And welcome to the D shop. Their gift shop for the stuff. Shop? The D shop. The D shop? Yeah, the D shop. Official the Detroit D's Tigers. Shop. Yeah. Official <laughs> Detroit Tigers merch. Used stuff, game That's one stuff. It's called paraphernalia. Shut up. But they have special um, 500 home run stuff on sale YouTubers. because of um, Miguel Cabrera finally hitting 500. This is the first home game since that happened. So I'm going to pick up a few things and then. Hopefully finally get this day rolling the correct way. I like this little area here. It's like a little like carnival type area. It has a bunch of food options and a big carousel in the middle. It's really, really cool, really, really nice. Um, but I got a Miguel Cabrera 500 home run pin. And then we got these floppy hats as well. Commemorative for the first 10,000 fans. So uh, that's pretty cool. Now we're gonna walk around and see what else we can find. What does that mean, Tyler? <laughs> it means nothing. Okay. Another nice little district area here with grass lawn cuttings of players. A fountain that probably should be working, but it's not. Well, it kind of is. I don't know why it's not is. There's some nice tigers. And then completes with the star attraction. Their star attraction, their big Ferris wheel. Made completely out of baseballs. No, that's not the shape like baseballs. Two dollars. I don't know. I don't know if it's really worth it. That is outdated. That is outdated. He hit 500. But look at all the, uh, actually I'll zoom back in. They've got all the retired numbers out in the wall there. Plus the beautiful Chevrolet fountain and then you go over. There's where we're sitting over there somewhere in right field. The Pepsi porch, their uh, VIP deck, and kind of walk around. You can look around. Another big ass scoreboard, which we'll get more views of later. Got some Chevrolet vehicles over here. We got Chevrolets, Terrace, official vehicle of the Tigers. And then a nice shot over there. But some nice cars here, I guess. There's a good shot of Ford Field, home of the Lions. And I'm guessing the reason why a parking was so fucking expensive is because the Lions are in town tonight for a preseason game against the Colts. It's still ridiculous. Already got Jared Goff over there. Damn, they're gonna suck this year. Then they also they had the statues out here, some of their more famous players like Willie Horton. Yeah, Ty Cobb. Ty Cobb. Ty Cobb? Never heard of Ty Cobb? Oh, Hank Greenberg. Right there. Charlie Granger. 
I think his last name is Hal Newhauser. Yeah. Then Al Colleen. Pretty cool. And I'm sure there will be a Cabrera one too when uh, he retires in a couple of years. So this is the view from our seats, exactly. We're actually in prime home run spot. Pretty good. Yeah, I know. This was $24 plus the $10 fee. The game store? But um, that's really good. And they get a nice shot of the stadium. We're already in shade. There's the big scoreboard again with more Tigers on it. The Chevrolet found. Wow, you get a real nice view here. This is cool. Took the seats are a little wet because it rained just today. Yeah. I don't know if it's just me or the TV or what, but the seat, there just doesn't seem to be a large capacity here than it seems like on TV. Like right over there, it looks like it can fit so much more people in there, but they don't. Or it just seems like, like, and then here, like, it seems like there should be like so many people packing here back when they were good. And it just doesn't seem like it could fit that many people really really weird guys look it's the valley sports detroit that i don't know they're pretty hard to see from here but they're doing a doing broadcasts and stuff they're really hard to see here they go they're talking now get a shout out better shot of them here because they decided to lift this thing up Behind the scenes, Tyler. Yeah. You can definitely tell what teleprompter he's reading off of. It's pretty funny. What cartoon there is. They're doing a 40 yard dash. Like shit, I look at something like Bojack. Outside of Ford Field here. The Lions are in town. I don't remember if I mentioned that or not. Do it. By all means, go do it. Good luck Let's give another kick kill. Yep, here he goes. Why are we recording random little kids running? Yeah. Because it's fun. Kappa. Kappa. Or Kappa. Hey, fuck, Kappa. Fuck Kappa. Big Piggy, Big Piggy, with the Tigers logo on it. Another Ernie Harwell statue. Legendary Tigers broadcaster, who has since passed away. Pretty cool. Today's first pitch delivered at 7-11 p.m. Oh yeah. I like 7 Guys, I got this big ass sandwich called the Pig Mac. It's got mac and cheese, pulled pork. It's also got jalapenos on it. I'll try and pick those off with a bunch of chips. Cole got a mac and cheese bowl. Now I got a pizza. What do you have to say? But uh, the game's about to start, so uh, here we go. Otter Anchor Cabrera's 500th home run. Glitch in the scoreboard right there. Part of the scoreboard I think is missing. See that black square? 
No. Don't touch. See that square there? I don't want to talk. Explain everything. Do you want to explain the multiverse? Away from huh? Multiverse. No, stop. Okay. I'm ruin their lives. You guys an idiot. He just keeps doing one versus everything else. As an idiot. Listen, lady in the white hat, no smoking. Literally, it's not that hard. You can't. <laughs> it's a no smoking car. Call security and get her out of here. Cole with that massive fucking elephant here, and Lucas with some dumb cars. I will be making a stop there because it is hot. Guys, if you couldn't tell. It like is hot. It's not even that hot. It's humid. Dude, try working on a carpet, man. To me it is. Try working on a carpet, man. Where you're literally using steam to clean the carpets. It's fucking miserable. Isn't that inside, though? That's even worse. How is that any better? Because you have air conditioning. There is no air conditioning. Sorry, rich boy. But East Lansing isn't as rich as people think it is. I don't know. I'm working minimum wage and I was able to afford shitloads of stuff, so. You don't pay for shit! <laughs> yeah, 965 an hour, Michigan minimum wage. I get more oh. than you. Why didn't you just do what Eli did and get in the produce department? I'm getting, we're getting a pay raise, though. It's coming, folks. Stay on the lookout. Top of it's the bottom of the fourth inning. No. Bad boy. Cabrera's up the bat. No outs. Well, one out. A double. Can he deliver? One nothing Blue Jays, by the way. Can he deliver to tie the game? Yeah, so we totally paid for these seats. Yeah. Can didn't we? see it three times. Yes. Well, you have to say it three that. times to make it good. We move seats. Say it in front of security, man, especially. Yeah, I know, right? We paid for a ticket, so I'm sure they couldn't care less at this point. It's now one to one. There's the Pepsi porch and everything. They were sitting underneath earlier. Look how crowded it over is over there. move and then they throw t-shirts over there like what the fuck <laughs> of course we move and then they move stuff in our section how coincidental Dog, snake, llama, or a cat? Definitely a cat. What? Smokey! <laughs> it's not even an option. Hyena also wasn't an option. What the fuck? Come on, dogs would be the nicest. Yeah, how would dogs? What? Yeah. What? Well, she won. 
time. If animals could talk, which one would be the rudest? It's definitely a cat. I'd say either a llama or a cat. And it's definitely more, more so a cat. Because llamas can still just llamas can still just give a projectile, aka the spit. So that would be kind of pointless at that point. Oh uh, yeah, he's gonna crush it. Bottom left. I mean, beat left field all there. Come on, Mickey. Got an RBI already. Uh, left field. Yeah, where all those people are. Is that a ball? Uh huh. It's Mickey Mouse in a Tigers uniform. How about that inside the park home run? Oh yeah. Can't barely even see it because of stupid, stupid camera angle. But we got a two to one ball game, and I got ice cream. Oh boy. We've moved again to the very top. There's the. There's the sound in there. Look at these great views. Beautiful, beautiful. Here in the bottom of the eighth. Okay. Great view of the Detroit skyline over there, too. It may be a shit show beneath, but it is great to look at. We're at the top of the ninth. the Blue Jays. Still one. Still two to one. It's the final out. They have to tie the game. Sorry for the win. Nice breeze Attention. <laughs> and then Cole, they won. Uh, yeah, we yeah. yeah, we were all watching. How do you feel? I can't believe we won. I know, right? <laughs> now, Lucas is the only other person to go to the Lug Nuts game besides me. What? You, talk, you kind of talked about this. Go, go, go. Order the pizza. Order the pizza. Order the pizza, Tyler. We will order the pizza. They're giving out free pizza. Well, it's a free two-liter with pizza. Hey, we gotta have something to do. This game no, ended too we early. Need a free two-liter. Okay. Anyway, this compared to a lug nuts game, what would you say is better? This was more fun. A yeah. lot more fun. Because the lug nuts game kind of sucked a lot. Because they, there, it there wasn't any tension. Because they fucking sucked. Because the lug nuts got beat by like nine runs, and then and they were already up by those nine runs. It was uh, def it's definitely a little more pricey, but it's definitely worth it. Now they're gonna do post game interviews. There's Little Caesars Arena, home of the. Do not touch my phone. 
home of the Red Wings and the uh, Pistons. Would it be funny if I just... <laughs> no. <laughs> no. There she is. I got shot at Ford Field. Might as well get a shot at that one too. Underneath the Fox Theater, it's been the end of our Tigers vlog. The game, the game is over, and as is this vlog. But I'll catch you guys in plenty more vlogs coming soon. So until next time, we'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Yeah,